Hey guys, welcome back, and let's check out the door, shall we? Is it this one? No, it's... Not this one, it's... This, no. 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 One of these buttons did it. That's one, yes. Okay, so support what have we got. Tita gives us negative speed, high dexterity, high digitality. She gives us low defense, but better item drop rates and seventh gain. She gives us low arts, which is not really what I want when I've got. You should do that because Josette's a good one for the general stuff. So, moon doors. The girl skills in urban engineering. Done that one. Haven't done that one. Okay. Star doors. The garden of all family. Done that one. Uh, 100 battles. Don't know if we've done that one. The boy with eyes of amber and the princess of the indomitable will. Well, I've got both of my party there. So, I can do that one, possibly. I'll try to look at that one first. Those who have not proved themselves in battle are not worthy of stepping inside. Should you wish to be deemed worthy, struggle through 100 battles, only then shall the door open. Okay. Are we not worthy yet? This one should be okay. Bring to me the boy with eyes of amber and a princess with indomitable will. An event to a door open. Star Chamber. I shall grant your memory fragment my blessing. Okay, thank you very much. Baking news! Flying City Falls, the world is safe once more. Glory to the young braces who have saved us. Mysterious structure that appeared last month over Valeria Lake disappeared as soon as it came, collapsing loudly in a giant mountain of rubble. Many of our readers have witnessed a moment for themselves, but it seems it was visible not only from Le Burl, but from the southern edge of the Empire, and from Calvard as well. A small minority argue destruction may have been a new weapon belonging to the Royal Army. The returns of events seems to inclusively to inclusively rule out of that possibility. The collapse of a liver arc also caused a too large high tsunami around the edges of the lake. But so far there have been no reports of serious injuries, fatalities, or missing persons. The worst seem First, what seems to have been reported is a number of unfortunate fishermen who were unable to escape in time, getting covered in water. According to investigation by the Royal Guard and Bracer Guild, it was a flying city from ancient Zamorian times. How exactly it came to be above Valeria Lake to begin with, or what caused it to collapse, remains to be confirmed. But it appears to be without doubt the International Crime Syndicate, known as a society, was somehow involved. But it's yet to be officially confirmed, reports also suggest that an investigation team in the city encountered a group of crimson soldiers reporting the above, supporting the above theory. This place is just one mystery or another, but we can't let those guys have away any more than we already have, said the member team. Furthermore, Zai Central Factory and Royal Army are planning on continuing investigating the Liber Arc. To this end, we'll be launching a combined salvage operation. Around the time of Liber Arc collapse, the Yobble shut down phenomenon that tormented the whole country finally ceased. As a result, many now believe the city caused the phenomenon, but no conclusive proof has been established. The Yobble shut down phenomenon and the chaos that was created as a result of being sobering reminded just how dependent all of us are and up into our daily lives. Perhaps something similar to may never happen again, but this is still a good opportunity to reflect on just how much we owe augments. Perhaps try to reduce our reliance on them. As previously reported, Her Highness Princess Claudia is now this nation's crown princess. 
As a result, we are referring to her as, as such in all publications moving forward. But Crown Princess Claudia wasted no time after assuming a position in meeting with Prince Oliver of the Oberbonian Empire. Together they reconfirmed our two nations' relationship with one another. After discussions, they both boarded the stay together. It's widely expected that a meeting will contribute to ensuring peaceful relations with Erebonia in the future. In addition, the repair planned both to be in attendance at the upcoming banquet to be held at Grantsville Castle. We'll bring you all the latest in that in due time. As you, all, as you all know, our homeland of Liberl has fallen victim to a vast number of calamities in the past year. There was a coup to tar, bizarre chains of tetracelic towers, come under the assault from an ancient dragon, and are comfortably intact. And finally, the Liber Ark's appearance has already been discussed in this very issue. What you may not know, however, is there is a group of young men and women who are involved in the resolution of all these crises. They still like an unwill and undying determination, leading them to conclusions. If not for them, these crises may not have been resolved or taken a turn for the worst. I would like to take this opportunity to thank them for all they have done for us. Thank you. You are with Trajan's true great hope. Great hope. <sighs> What's taking you so long, Dorothy? Gonna move on or I'm gonna leave you behind. Wait for me! No time for waiting. It takes much longer. The banquet's gonna start without us. We're talking about a big celebration to help our queen here. Being late is an option. I'm so hungry. Can't walk another step. I have a horrible feeling I know what's going on here. You skipped lunch so you can eat more of a banquet, didn't you? I didn't even eat breakfast. I haven't eaten a thing since yesterday. Going 30 hours without eating is making me feel kind of lightheaded. What the hell are you thinking? I can't move. Come on, we're going there. No way we can miss an occasion like this. Personal agenda snapping a photo of Her Majesty and a Crown Princess. And then. Uh, huh? That isn't so bad. At one point, <laughs> thanks for the effort to everyone here, and many others, as well, all is well. This humble banquet is intended to be an occasion to celebrate that fact, as well as to honour those who contributed to making a reality. If you would, Claudia. Of course. All those invited to today's party contributed in one way or another to protecting the peace of Liberl by ending the peril we faced with. Whether it was extending the helping hand to those in need or working to fight off the threats that instilled fear in the hearts of people. As this country's future monarch, I would like to extend my deepest gratitude to each and every one of you. Thank you all very much. Well, this party is nothing compared to all that you have done, but we've just made it. How are you doing eating your mate? You got a picture steak. Um, well, I do hope you will enjoy your time here all the same. I'm sure you're all busy men and women, burdened by great responsibilities and concerns, but today I would ask you to all cast those aside in order to rest, relax, and enjoy yourselves. Food on offer here is the same as some of the finest in the burls. By all means, partake until you can take no more, and may God be blessing this nation. Chloe really is something else. Not sure I could dress in super nice and get in front of a crowd like this and make a big speech the way she did. Yeah, she is. She said she wasn't really feeling confident about how she's doing as a crown princess before, but from where I'm standing, she's doing just fine. Seeing is making me kind of jealous though. Wish I could put up every fancy dresses all the way she does. You got something to say, mister? Oh, it's nothing. Just know all that girly most of the time, so it'll take me by surprise when you suddenly are. What do you mean, I'm not girly? Sure, lately, we've been, all we've been doing is helping get Nibel back in shape. That doesn't mean I don't want to wear a pretty dress for me once in a while. So it really is surprising just how much you've grown in these past few weeks. I have? It's been pretty tough winning up and down the country so much. And the adjustments are based on getting more on spot on. Fancy dress or not, I think you're a pretty wonderful person, Estelle. I don't know why, but it's weird hearing you pile on compliments so much. What can I say? I'm glad things seem to have finally calmed down a bit. The capital might not be getting entirely the way it was, but 
Oh, it's getting there. I think we can finally afford to take a breather. Oh, look! Look at all that food! Chefs on Castle supposedly make the entire bread, too. There's no way I'm missing out on this. I didn't get to enjoy the food back during the birthday festivities. It's now my time to pick out big time. Stay right here, okay, Joshua? I'm going to go scope out the goods. Ah, she might have grown in some areas, but she's still got some ways to go in others. Hey, look. How are you doing, Joshua? Still not here with you? I just went to get some food a second ago. You two here for more work for fun? Bingo. I haven't had to that many occasions where it's only famous famous to get going in one place. There's no way we could pass up a chance of coming to score some interviews. So don't you think you're getting out here without get answering some questions? So no going home until you've spoken to all of us, alright? Up to it, Dorothy. I can't go on. I need something to eat. We have something to eat. Not until we're done. Question to ask. Photos to take. Why are you so mean? <laughs> He's even more fired up than usual today. Wonder how Estelle's doing. As one would expect. So much of scoping out the food. Oh, it's a good chance there's any. I would like to meet people here on a personal level too. I should go in and thank them while I have a chance. Hey! I'm sure a lot of guests today. Thanks for bidding a general bite, General. That's the yes. <laughs> right then. I was in pitch to find you here. Still, thank you very much for your support. Oh, please, I only did what I did because of his excellency's bail conditions. Make no mistake, I wouldn't have helped any worthless Drex otherwise. Oh, Joshua! Been a long time since last saw ya. Between last time I heard there's a plan in motion to pull Libo Ark. You heard right. Not to say it'll be easy, of course. For Larry's Lake's fire deep. Intended to work out by making a map. So when are you coming? Oh no, I mean them even Oh, Joshua. Uh, making rounds. Something like that, yeah. Anything interesting going on? Sort of. Agate said he's gonna come over for dinner. I was asking when it's free. That's right, so he did. Maybe we were getting off the ISA, right? I don't really mean it though, just one of those things you say in passing, but didn't give much thought to it. And exactly it's swinging in free time, you know, being a racer. I'd like to go, sure, but I've got no idea if I'll actually have time to do it. I've been looking forward to you coming ever since. Uh, okay, let me think. Maybe end of a month, that should be okay. I think Friday's free. Really? Is that a promise? Yeah, I guess. <coughs> oh, hello down here. You two look comfortable. Oh, if it isn't Joshua. Care to join us for a few drinks? Don't be shy now. But night is only just beginning. But I want to see those exquisite amber eyes of your swim before it comes to a close. I'm good, thanks. Ah, come on, we're celebrating your banquet here. Don't be such a spore sport. Oh, I know. Why don't we have a few drinks to celebrate? You're becoming a scene of brace at the same time. It was like it was ages ago, but we never did get to celebrate your promotion. Only Estelle's. Say, so, sure. About, well, Luciola. Ha. <laughs> see, Joshua. What are you getting all worried about her for? You really need. We really, we really needn't be. That's Cheryl's right. Especially not now. We have our concerns and worries after all that happened over the past few weeks and months. But this is not a time to be thinking about them. It's a time to be making merry and drowning in fine drink. I mean, there's no time not to be making merry as far as you're concerned. It's got a point, though. And while I've got the chance to say this to you, no more going off on your own, you hear? 
got no intention of doing anything like that again. That docile expression of yours is so adorable, Joshua. Don't go showing that off face too much, okay? Oh, it's you. Heard you've been lending a hand with me with the situation efforts. Is there enough food available for you? Oh, greetings, Joshua. I'd like to take this chance to thank you again. My debt of gratitude you is beyond measure. Please, you're good at that rating, sir. It's only because of you, Richard Kurtz, and the others fighting on the ground, we were able to succeed. So I wanted to thank you for a while. Faith, we had a new to see your work through to the end was what we needed to fight. Oh, Joshua, it's been quite some time. Didn't know you were here, Mayor Claus. Mayor's City is here. I'm particularly well received here. We all know how dire things were at the time. You've got as much right to be here as that thank you for your efforts as everyone else. Well, it's finally all over. It just goes to show that the more we endure, the goddesses will eventually extend her hand of salvation to us. This is some party, isn't it? I don't think you'll find a banquet of a guest list quite like this anywhere. I used to be a businessman, so I've been to my fair share of occasions like this. I've never been to anything with many famous people. Oh, you need to worry about us. The academy suffered no major damage. Certainly a shock to students, but we're all back to your usual cheery selves. It is a pleasure to see you again, Joshua. You too, Leela. You've been well? I have, thank you. Although I wish I could say the same for a mayor. She clapped from overworking herself the other day. As such, I had no choice but to force her to take some time off work. I'm afraid so. She was finally able to rest and recover enough to my satisfaction. I assure you that she's in good hands. Henry Academy was actually occupied by armed assailants at one point. I was so worried I first heard the news. You know what? Let's go downstairs and continue the party. Next episode. Bye bye. Cry for me.